I live in Orlando and I make all shop with me videos at like TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Home Decor, Target, Walmart, World Market, Big Lots, tons of fun stores. So if you love home decor, seeing what's new at your favorite stores, what sales there are, what the current seasonal decor is, if you just want to be an informed shopper and know what you can look for next time you go out shopping, definitely make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. Today's video is going to be a TJ Maxx shop with me. I don't do a lot of videos just at TJ Maxx, so I'm really excited. We've been finding fall decor in all the other stores. Not a ton, just a little bit, and I know a lot of you guys are like, what the heck, it's not at my stores yet. Soon, I promise. If we have it, it must be coming really, really soon, so keep your eyes peeled. Check back every few days because fall decor is about to be at your stores, I promise. Don't get mad at me. But like I said, I don't shop at TJ Maxx very much, so I'm really excited to get inside and see what they have. I'm really looking for, like, I don't know, I'm trying to show items that I don't show too much, so I'm probably gonna be branching out into some different sections. I don't know if I'm gonna be showing that much clothing. If you wanna see clothing in future videos, please let me know down below. I just feel like when I like focus on clothing, you guys don't enjoy the videos as much, so just please let me know down below. I could definitely be wrong, my observation could be wrong, so please just weigh in in the comments and let me know your feedback. With all that being said though, I'm super excited to get in there, so let's head inside to TJ Maxx and see what's new this week. Maybe some fall decor? Maybe, I don't know. So I'm downtown where I used to live and this is the problem. See the Super Target? Right next to the TJ Maxx. Oh, I miss it so much. They have so many pretty accessories. These caught my eye right when I walked in. I haven't seen anything like these. These must be new. Look at this like really, really pretty bracelet. I love the mixed metals. Only $10, just little hands. I just love it. I love the mixed metals. Then they have a lot of really cool hoops for $7.99. I love like the hammered look of them and how they're gold, but they're not like a shiny gold. They're more of like a matte gold. They have this oval pair. They also have this round pair that is more of like a traditional hoop. These ones are again $7.99. They have these like thicker, shinier ones that are also pretty these ones are 10 they also have these ones that hang down I don't have any earrings like this so I'm considering picking these up I just love like minimal earrings like this where you know you just catch a glimpse of it, it just adds a little something to your outfit but doesn't like take over your whole face I just like that they just add a little something extra and these are only $7.99 the shape of these ones is really cool this is more of like the traditional shiny gold these ones are $7.99 and I really really like these ones as well love the shape of these ones these ones are $9.99 and I I love how there is like more substance to them but because they're more of the matte gold again they don't stick out too much and like take over your whole outfit they do as well have some silver options I don't show too much silver on here honestly the stores haven't been carrying it very much gold is definitely very much what's in um, but if you want to see more silver options definitely let me know in the comments below I just found this on there look at this little tiny bag tiny bags are like very popular right now they're obviously not functional at all but they are very on trend and this one is extremely adorable on the inside it does have a full-length strap so you can wear it crossbody and this little purse is ten dollars they also have some like glasses chains but they also show them as mask chains so if you have a bunch of mask chains that you don't use anymore you can use them as glass chains so they have these these are really adorable I really really like these and these are by Cynthia Rowley and they are ten dollars for the two they do have the more expensive like gold plated nicer jewelry in the case so if you're looking for a gift this is a really great place to check in the cases you're gonna find really good quality jewelry but still at like a really good like TJ Maxx price so definitely an awesome place to shop for a gift if you have someone in your life that loves jewelry like me they also have a pretty good selection of like men's jewelry chains things like that this is really awesome I have not seen a lot of this stuff here before Definitely a great place to look for a gift. Brian loves bracelets. I don't know if you have a guy in your life that loves bracelets, but this is a really good place to look. 
Next, I want to move over to home decor. If you've been watching a lot of my videos, you've seen we've seen some sprinkles of fall, mostly at Home Goods. We did find a little bit at Marshall, so I'm really excited to see if we find any here at TJ Maxx. These planters caught my eye. They're very pretty. I like love the colors. They have this like slate blue color, this minty kind of sagey teal color. And then it comes in like a mocha color, but I just love how modern and sleek they are, but I love the colors. They just have a, like a lot of planters. I'm pretty surprised. Maybe they're like getting rid of them once and for all. So they just got like their last shipment of them probably because fall is definitely incoming. I see some. Okay, so the first fall stuff I have found, fall and Halloween, are these little items right here. So they do have some gnomes. I actually haven't seen any gnomes yet. This one just has little bats with a little gray beard, which is so cute. And this is $10. They actually have two of these. Then they have these tiny little candy corns, which I'm in love with. They just have like a little smiley face. These are $7.99. I don't think I'm going like the cutesy route with my decor or else I would definitely buy these. I mean, I could always turn them around, but I don't know. I just don't know. And they have like a little friend. Then there's this little ghost that just has a little boo. I really like this as well. It is weighted on the bottom, similar to how the gnomes are. This guy here is $12.99. I just don't know about cutesy stuff yet. I know when we have kids, I'm going to want to do like all the cutesy stuff. So I feel like while we don't have kids, I'm trying to like not do this type of like items for decor. I don't know if that makes sense out loud, but it makes sense in my head. I don't know. Do you guys know what I mean? All right. Next, they have this really pretty skull that is like carved. Feels like it is ceramic and it is $9.99. It just has like a bunch of gold on it. It is super pretty. They have these plush pumpkins. I have not seen any of these yet, so I really like these. These are only $6.99. They have this sequiny one. They also have this black and white one, which I feel like if I was sticking with black and white, that would go really well with the decor I already have. And then they have this plaid one rack here that is gray. They have more of the little ghosts. They have this one, and then these ones are like the one we already saw, but this one, it still says boo, but this one has flags and he does not have a hat. They have this set of three gnomes that spell out boo. Very, very colorful. I feel like if you like colorful decor, if you have kids, that sort of thing, this is great. The three gnomes are $12.99. Then they have this six foot garland which comes with the little white pumpkins with the green and almost like macaroni and cheese and ivory colored pom-pom balls six feet and this is $14.99 for $14.99 they have that same garland but in more of like autumnal colors like traditional orange pumpkins with red orange and yellow balls this is adorable, but I think I'm gonna get that one. I think I like the other color better. Down here they have the biggest version of the little Oasty Ghosty. He has a little top hat and just holding a little banner that says Boo. This is $20. Then they have these big like candy pots almost. I actually have one of these from a different year and I think I'm gonna go ahead and spray paint it this year. This small one is $6.99. The medium is $7.99 and then the biggest one is $14.99. Then they also come in this whitewash version this year but these ones don't say trick-or-treat they just have little jack-o-lantern faces and they're brushed with like gold these ones are very pretty same thing $6.99 $7.99 and $14.99 for these okay continuing with like the marble bust trend that we've been seeing at TJ Maxx Marshalls and Home Goods, they're just getting bigger like this is this is bigger than human size like it's massive it's actually on clearance for $72 so this is in Orlando downtown if you want a giant marble bus. So they have all this bedding over here. It says spend less, summer more. But I don't know, these are giving me big like fall, summer transition fall items. I've been saying that about sunflowers. They have this set of three decorative pillow like trio set for $34.99, which is a really good deal because it's like less than $15 a pillow. It's like $12 a pillow. So that's really cool. If you love sunflowers and mustard, these are a great deal and they have these in the store right now. Then they also have these sets of like two pillows and then I really, really like these ones. They're kind of like sunflowers, but it seems kind of like a dead sunflower. I don't know, I just really like the coloring of them. I think they are very pretty and you can get two of these for $24.99. Few more fall items. This welcome mat is really, really pretty. I like love the colors of it. Love that one. And then they have this one that's like this big red pickup truck. So that one is really pretty as well with a bunch of sunflowers in the back. It's a really, really good size as well. This one is $24.99. And then this one's actually $30, which I feel like is a lot for here, especially for like a welcome mat. I'm not really sure why it, it oh, 
Okay, wait, maybe it's not $30. I thought that was attached, but it wasn't. Hang on, let's investigate. Oh, $7.99. Okay, that's what I thought. I was like, $30? That's a bit outrageous for a welcome mat, especially at TJ Maxx. $7.99 for this one, $24.99 for this one. For $130, they have six of these coffee tables. I've never seen a store have so many of one item, like especially a table like this. That's pretty unheard of. What's cool is that like you could pick what you want the grain to look like because you have so many options. These are $130. The legs are black, but you could easily spray paint them. So that's nice. It's very like customizable piece, super like neutral. You could make it work with like lots of different decor styles. And it's a really good size too. So this is definitely a great find. They also have a matching dining bench and matching bar stools so this would be like a great day to come if you were like looking for a lot of different furniture because you could have like a whole living room set right here dining bar stools coffee table definitely interesting to see this much of like one item they also have two of these like console tables they are on sale for 149 I don't know if they just like had them for a long time but they're really pretty I like how they have some shelves that you can decorate and then some for storage perfect for like an Xbox or maybe like a Roku or sound bar right under here and then you could decorate it or put your TV directly on it but this is really nice as well I love this really simple desk just the black legs just with one drawer Pretty shallow drawer, but would be good for like pens, pencils, maybe a notepad, nothing much thicker than that. But I really love like the dark color of the wood. It's really, really nice. And this is $130. And again, they have two of them. I really like this nightstand. It honestly would be like the perfect size. It's a bit too rustic for what we're looking for, but I do like the hardware on it. And it's not like I could really like make it look less rustic maybe i could paint it black but that'd be pretty much it it's 80 dollars. they only have one so i can't even really think about diys when there's only one of them but i really like this as well some nice benches i really like this decorative chair i love the color of it they also have it in gray lots of little like bar stools and different chair options lots of different fabrics and all of these are under 100 dollars a piece peeking at just the Ray Dunn. It is Halloween time for Ray Dunn, so I just wanted to see if I could find anything. They have these new mugs that are like locations. I found San Fran, so they have the Golden Gate Bridge on the back. Also found this one that says Aloha that actually has a pineapple on the back. My friend Megan already got this one for me, so I'm going to leave this for someone else to find. Then they have this one that says Sweetie. They have one that says cat mom which is super funny i know a couple of you that watch are cat mom so shout out to you guys i love you so much they have this one that says looking sharp with a cactus on the back that's super funny so brian has been begging me to get like appetizer plates because when we have people over like when we make a cheese board and stuff we don't have small plates so they do have these ones and i actually found them in like a set of four so i might pick these up for 12.99 i don't know i really don't like them that much but I mean, just to appease him, I might get those. But I also am planning on being at a Home Goods later today, and I feel like they'll have a lot more options because Home Goods, of course, is just like all this home stuff. So I might just wait and look there because, like, worst comes to worst, I'm sure they'll probably have the exact same ones, so I could just buy them there. But then also too, I noticed that stuff is more expensive at Home Goods. So like, these plates are $12.99 here, and at Home Goods they could be like $16.99. I have noticed that in my many travels of shopping between all the different stores, especially like on the same day and, and like looking at identical items. I have noticed that. Did you guys know that? They do that. Okay, I just saw that these are on clearance for 10. So I might actually get these. The problem is that like if I find ones that I like better, it'll be hard for me to return these because I don't come to TJ Maxx very often. I go to Marshalls and Home Goods a lot more. Ugh, I don't know. What do I do? For fall, I am looking to do like more of like a table arrangement, table setting. So I've been looking. They don't have a lot of options here. But these ones caught my eye. These like really cool wooden ones. I don't know. They're just like these little wooden tiles. And I just found that one to be really, really different. So I like that. They do have some fall indoor-outdoor tablecloths. Sunflowers, of course. Sunflowers are the thing this year. If you don't like them, kind of like me, then we're gonna have to look beyond the sunflowers to find cute fall decor. They do have these like pretty yellowish colored ones. Pack of six is only $9.99, so that's a pretty good deal. And then if anything happens to one, at least you have like a backup because my table only seats four. 
These ones are really pretty as well. I love like the wovenness of them and it is $12.99 for a pack of six. I also like the scalloped edge. I don't know, I just like these ones. Those ones are really pretty as well. Also, I'm looking for fall towels. Don't see anything here yet. These are all just like extremely neutral. These are actually the exact ones I have. So they've been selling these for a really long time. I love them. You get three and they just wash really well. They're super good quality. They're really absorbent, but still nice and soft really thick good quality kitchen towels this is the brand if you want to see and they're just striped but they do have these like little polka dots really really neutral these ones are ten dollars for the three pack okay this is a pretty cool item i've never seen one of these here and it really matches our decor plus we actually need one of these it is a meat tenderizer it is 7.99 I think I might go ahead and pick this up because this is an item that we need and it would look really nice. Just mixed in with like all of our other like wooden spoons, spatulas, things like that because they're this really pretty wood tone. So I might pick this up because it's an item that we actually really, really need. We've had to use the most random household items. I don't even want to get into it, but we need this. There's a bunch of great like pots and pans on clearance, like a huge, huge pot, perfect for like soups or like batch making, pasta sauce, or I don't know, whatever you cook that's like needs a huge pot, maybe a bunch of pasta, something like that if you're cooking for a big family. So they have a big pot like that on clearance and it comes with a lid. They also have like smaller size ones, they have big frying pans, they just have like a ton of really good pots on sale. They do also have some like baking items. So they have a bunch of these Caflon baking sheet muffin tins on clearance. They also have these pizza pans on clearance for $6. This is nice because they have the circles on the bottom so it really helps cook the bottom. I typically like to put my pizza right on the rack because I like my pizza to be really crispy but that helps with that. Then they have a bunch of these Ray Dunn canisters on clearance that say like grandma's cookies. These are really pretty. These are from Mother's Day. And then just so many birdhouses. So many. Like endless birdhouses just a really small lamp collection here but i really like this one so i wanted to show it to you i love the white linen shade with this bottom love that it's like seagrass or sawgrass is what it's called i can't ever get it right i'm pretty sure it's seagrass but i really like it and it's woven with the white this one is really really pretty this one is 24.99 i really like it they only have one then they have two of these which i also like these are a bit more like farmhouse for sure but i love the different like glazing this one's glazed and this one's more raw and then it has these like really pretty like metal handles and i just like how it looks like a pot but then it's a light and it has a really pretty like ivory colored lampshade these are a great size i can't find a price anywhere on these i just searched so i don't know the price on these i'm so sorry okay i know i never ever ever show these but i wanted to show you some picture frames that stick out to me i never talk about picture frames we don't have lots of picture frames around our house but there are always really pretty ones so there's this one for 5.99 it's round and i just love how carved and like ornate it is similarly they have this one that is more rectangular typical like four by six picture frame this is 6.99 and the round one was 5.99 but i just really like these they're also like very smooth I just love how like neutral and pretty they are. They have a bunch more of those up here in white. Then they also have this one that is more of like a gray wash. So it's like gray inside instead of white, which I really like. They just have a bunch. This one is really cool. Look at this one. It looks like it was like taken right out of like a tree trunk almost. It's very, very natural looking. Would be perfect for like a cabin or if you have like a more rustic space, maybe an office as a gift. Then they do have like more simple, sleek, modern ones, simple gold ones like this in all different sizes, all ranging from like $3.99 to $6.99. This one is nice. I love this one. This one would be really nice for Polaroid pictures. This one would hold three Polaroid pictures, and this one is $7.99. They do also have frame sets, so if you want to make a gallery wall, they have sets of like three. This one is a set of three for $24.99, and they all match, and they're all the same size. It's a perfect start to making a gallery wall, and you can get the frames here for a really good price. These signs are so fun to welcome, and you can just write like the Wi-Fi password. These are perfect to put like on your TV stand as a decoration. That way, if someone's like, what's your Wi-Fi password? You can just point them over to it, and they can easily read it, especially if you have like 
a weird Wi-Fi password like most people do like they don't let you pick it so it's like a bunch of random letters and numbers but this is a really good idea and they always have lots of different styles if you don't like this one you could definitely look on Amazon they have a bunch of different like fonts and styles that are more like modern but this is just a really good idea if you have like a lot of guests over this will just save you a lot of time like not having to tell them the password or try to find it it's just written right here for them this sign is $6.99 if you or if you have someone in your life that like loves to craft they have these great sets of like markers and brush pens as well as calligraphy books and like acrylic painting sets and all of this really awesome stuff they also have some puzzles which I really like but this would be a great way to save on these like craft accessories especially like the calligraphy set that would be a really fun gift if you have a child that's really artistic so they have this stuff here as well I feel like they have it really well organized at this store they do have a bunch of like wedding -y type items so if you're getting married they have this card box that comes with a lock so that nobody can like get inside of it that is not supposed to and just a little slit on the top so this is just a clear little card box I really like this one normally wedding cards are like very pretty so it would make like really good decor that it's clear you could see the cards on the inside and like I said the security feature with the lock is really awesome this is $20 then they also have this set of like table numbers so you can like make your own table numbers you can either put like a decal on it or if you know someone or if you have great like handwriting you could also practice that a lot and just write on them yourself that's a great way to save money and these are ten dollars another item they have is this clear with a gold frame it says oh snap hashtag and then you'd put like whatever your hashtag is like I don't know like over Joyce or whatever I don't know Brian's last name is Joyce that's the first thing I could think of and it just says help us capture our special day and you just customize it with your own paint pen so that's a good way for people to know what to hashtag on their pictures so you can look them up after the wedding this is actually on clearance for four dollars so if you're getting married soon definitely check TJ Maxx Marshall's home goods for this type of item because this normally comes out in the spring so by now all this stuff is on clearance so definitely check if you like this item or any of the other ones I've shown your store probably also has this stuff on clearance like why why was she like, yeah, let's make this design? I really don't get it. Or this one. Like, what is that? <laughs> it's supposed to be an apple. It's so weird looking. For $12.99, they have this little, like, silver chain decor. These are really popular right now for layering. So you can definitely find these items here. This is a silver one. I have not seen a silver one. I've seen, like, wood or, like, a bronze-colored one. So if you've been looking for silver, you could definitely check your stores. They have a bunch of sunflower florals that they're bringing in for fall transition. So if you're looking for that, definitely check. Look what I found pumpkin candle so excited mm. <laughs> smells so good I also see one right here this one is apple honey butter oh my god it smells so good <laughs> I haven't like smelled anything like this in so long. We're all like watermelon and pineapple scents in our house right now, very fruity. So something like, I don't know, like cinnamony just smells like, so incredible. It makes me want a Starbucks. I haven't talked about this at all on my channel, but I actually quit Starbucks. I haven't had Starbucks in like a month, which is crazy. Um, ooh, this smells good. This is Martha Stewart Sweet Honey. Um, but yeah, I had to quit Starbucks because I actually joined Weight Watchers. I've gained a bit of weight since Brian and I started dating and I just don't like feel comfortable with it. I really want to lose the weight and I did Weight Watchers a long time ago when I was in college, lost 60 pounds. So I know that it works and I just really like it. It teaches you like portion control and it just is like lessons that stick with you like eating in moderation and things like that. So I'm doing that so I can't have Starbucks not every day like I was. I'm sure I'll eventually have it like as a treat, but I can't have it every day like I was because it takes up like a majority of my points every day, which is crazy because it has so much sugar. But yeah, I had to quit Starbucks. So these cinnamon candles make me want Starbucks. So <laughs> I gotta go. Okay, just to give you a little haul of the items I'm picking up, like I said, I'm gonna pick up this garland. This is $14.99. I feel like I might end up using this, but also I might not, but I just wanna pick it up just in case. Then I also found this Explore More mug. I have not seen a Ray Dunn mug like this before. I don't necessarily know if I'm gonna buy this, but I sent a picture to my friend Megan from Loving Life as Megan. You guys probably know and love her. She collects Ray Dunn a lot still, so I wanted to see maybe if she wants this to like trade or something. Then I also picked up the meat tenderizer. This is going to be $7.99. And then the appetizer plates. I'm still kind of deciding if I'm gonna be honest, but 
I don't know. I think I might get these. And these earrings, I forgot that these were buried in my cart. I really, really like these ones. I don't have anything like them. They're only $7.99, so I'm gonna pick them up and treat myself. Look at these in the checkout aisle, these 2022 planners. Is anyone else really excited for next year? Is that just me? I'm so excited. So this just made my heart like flutter. I don't know, I'm just really excited for next year. I feel like it's gonna be a really good one. Bunch of really cute notepads. Love this one that comes with the pen and it just has little pineapples all over it and it's also magnetized, which is great. You can put it right on your fridge and just like leave little grocery notes or whatever to do lists. Alrighty, you guys, that is gonna be it for me today. I really hope that you enjoyed seeing everything that was new at T. DJ Max. If you did and you haven't yet, please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps out my channel. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and feel free to hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every single time I post a new video. You won't miss any of them. I post four videos a week if you didn't know. I'm up to four videos a week, so constant content coming at you and it seems like you guys have been really loving it and I've been loving putting it out. So thank you so much. Please subscribe if you have not yet. Today's questions with Katie question comes from Jane Brown and she said, have you always been a Florida girl or did you grow up somewhere else and move there so if you are new here you might not know that I'm actually from Boston I'm from Massachusetts I'm actually from Medford Massachusetts which is a city right outside of Boston it's like less than 10 minutes to get into the city so I grew up there born and raised right outside of the city I loved it there I love the history I love the snow which a lot of you guys might be really surprised to hear that I absolutely love the snow it's something I miss so much I really miss the true fall weather like of going apple picking and those sorts of activities the holidays it took years for me to really feel like the holidays were really the holidays not having the cold weather and the snow and all those fun activities that like lead up to it but I have been able to find substitutes here in Florida that make me just as happy like apple festivals pumpkin patches that are like not real pumpkin patches but it's good enough apple cider donuts true apple cider so definitely have found little events here that make me feel just like they did at home but I did move here to work for Disney which I talked about in my last video how I used to work for Disney so I've not always been a Florida girl but I I definitely feel like I was made to live in Florida. I love the Sunshine State. I just feel like the sun is so good for your soul and it's such a mood booster to live here and everything is so colorful. The trees, the flowers, everything is just so colorful and beautiful and it just really makes me so happy every single day to wake up and live here. I'm so happy, so grateful, and so proud of myself for making that happen. So, grew up in Boston but moved now to Florida and I see myself living here for a really 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 long time Brian and I our goal is to have houses in all the places we love so like Florida Charleston probably one in Arizona where a lot of his family lives maybe one up in Massachusetts where my family lives the possibilities are definitely endless but that is definitely our goal so born in Boston grew up in Florida thank you so much Jane for submitting that question with Katie if you want to be featured in an upcoming questions with Katie segment please make sure to leave me a comment down below it's always fun to have a lot of comments to choose from so please make sure if you have a question to leave me down below so I can feature it in an upcoming video but that is it for today's TJ Maxx Shop With Me. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.